Hello gamers and welcome back to another week of Lord of the Rings Battle for Middle Earth 2. This week we are playing the Age of the Ring mod. So we are doing a 4v4. We end up being put as the Woodland Realm, which are the elves from Mirkwood. We also have some troops that we can use that are from Dale, but we don't use them, they're a bit pants. We spam out a load of archers and we try and hold the line against one wave of enemy. While the enemy essentially spam the northern side of the map and they get straight into my base. However, we fight them back. It's quite a long match, quite an enjoyable back and forth. Uh, but without further ado, let's jump on in. And we are back playing Battle for Middle Earth 2, playing on the Age of the Ring mod. Today we are doing a 4v4, all on the soldier difficulty, random armies, no captains. Uh, so we're holding the top part against the enemy who will be down in the southern part. We're on the map Evendim. Lake Evendim is a large lake in northern Eriador. After the fall of the Numenorian, uh, Elendil established the capital of Arnor, a Numenus on uh, the southern shore of the lake. So Numenus should be around here, but fine. Let's jump on him. Uh, so I'm playing as the Woodland Realm. Got Rivendell, Rohan, Isengard on my team against three Rohans and one Lothlorien. This will be interesting. <laughs> um, I don't know how this is going to play out. Uh, I don't... I've been struggling on playing this on this difficulty against soldiers, uh, just because it's actually quite difficult. Uh, summon some, that's a tree. Let's give our guys a buff, shall we? All right, no, first things first, let's build a vineyard. Uh, vineyard up here gives us resources. And I don't oh, think... Yes. What is it you need? So that's a vineyard. And that recruit reduces the cost of our units as well. So let's buy up, build that. Now let's see what heroes we can get out straight away. So we can get Legolas, Grimborn, Radagast, Farron, uh, Galleon, Turiel, and King Thranduil. Let's call in Legolas straight away. Uh, let's look at the map. So there's some goblins just south here. So we get Legolas to take out those goblins as soon as possible. Probably want to build another one of these. Um, probably actually two more of these, uh, what are they called, resource buildings. Build this one next. Uh, build that just there. So we've got four to start off with. Then we can start building out some troops. Uh, we we'll wait for Legolas to spawn. Okay, so almost halfway. What can we spawn from these? Nothing from those. And we build some archers, some hunters from these. Relatively cheap. We can only have five of them. So we get we get five of these just to assist Legolas at the early game. We need more resources. Right, so that's another building complete. Awesome. Uh, that's, so Legolas is almost done. That's three of the art, uh, three of the hunters done. We can have five of them. Uh, so they can lay traps. And... Uh, uh, our fast scouts only resources when killing foes, so they, they're pretty good. As long as we have a melee unit to help defend them, they should be okay. So I think they are very squishy. Uh, so Legolas is almost out. Legolas is out. It's good. And then we want, ideally, we'll build one more resource building. Actually, no, no, let's not build another resource building. Let's just go straight for building troops. Uh, so you want this building out. Uh, how are all my, all my hunters doing? So we've got two more hunters on their way. Uh, let's get Legolas to start clearing down here. But these hunters can start clearing down here as well. And then pink. So there's, these are some enemy down there. You go and assist over here as well. So we're against uh, pink. So green, orange and yellow are on our team. Uh, obviously this purple down here are not. Let's go and see if we can take them out. So they're just letting them have free reign around our base. Normally they decided to go the long way around. Uh, you hunter as well. You see if you can assist them. There's only three of them left. Did they survive? Okay, we've got an ally over there. Fine, that's good. Um, so we've got this building here. We've got a little bit of spare resources. Build that there. Whereas our builder, you can build one uh, just down here. So we've got this to build archers. We'll build some troops. So those dagger warriors, those are... Um, Good against infantry, these can stealth near trees. Dagger warriors, so we ideally want. I think probably the way forward of these. Pikemen. Let's go for the pikemen. This is your end, creature. Elven and and some rabble, whoever's these. <laughs> they look absolutely insane. They don't know what's going on. They don't even know what day it is. Uh, so we can get pikemen. We can't get any upgrades from those. That's fine. Uh, we should have nearest builder. So we want 
is it elite is an elite elven barracks we've got that building so I, I've not played the Greenland realm so I've not played these people before so I'm just completely guessing what we need here uh, but I'm getting a fair bit of resources from killing enemies with these hunters okay they took all of my resources there uh, not really nice of them to be quite honest um, you guys are my only troops I've got, so you guys can make your way down and start assisting down here. Um, let's see what the elite building has to offer. Uh, so we're building that royal barracks. Uh, this treasury, we build a treasury, I guess. And you guys can essentially assist down here as much as possible to try and keep them at bay. I'm not going to bother with building like a navy or anything like that. Uh, just pure uh, rangers. For the time being, we have constructed right. So the, this elite elven one is built. So sword masters, spear slayers, a strong versus spam. Okay, let's get let's get two of these out. Let's see how strong they are against spam. All right. So these are the uh, siege grounds, cellar doors, grants small amount of resources. So that is a tunnel system. This is a defensive tower. This hills. And that's uh, okay, fine. So we just we are just missing the siege grounds that's by that over here. Let's see how my troops are doing. Okay, they're just set back here, pew pewing. That's good. I'm not sure where. Okay, Legolas is in in the middle of this fight here as well. There he is. He can train his archers. So let's see see if he can actually level up these. Oh, he's leveled them all up. Awesome. All right, just keep firing on these. We do get experience for each one of the, well, um, money for each one that dies. Very useful. Right, so these are the spam units, apparently. They're very good to counter spam. With that in mind, let's get a couple. Can we get archers from here? We can. We just need to level this up. That's fine. Uh, this is the, um, since the forge. It allows us to make, uh, buy upgrades. Right, they've got a lot of troops down there. So I'm just going to essentially keep behind my ally. We've got two units of these spam. So let's make these guys come down as well. And then I wouldn't mind some more ar some archers from the here as well. These bow warriors. Uh, they are riders. These are hall watchers. So these look like they are pikemen as well. So my one fear is these horsemen they've got. Uh, they could be quite dangerous uh, my allies are fighting this side of the map as well so we've got a lot of enemies inside this guy's camp if we can push one side i'll be relatively happy so our siege works is ready so we want ideally this this blister uh, can we build any other um resource buildings uh, that's quite fine let's build one there Okay, so you guys are down here as well. Awesome. I would actually put you all on the same command button. Uh, let's fight our way down. Right, this is now a high enough level, so let's get... Oh, I wouldn't mind another hero, to be honest. Let's get banners. And then, ideally, let's get two of these when we can. Or even just one, to be honest. Uh, okay, let's keep pushing. My fear is obviously these guys on, the, on our flank might not be able to hold. So these we can only get steel and banners, which is fine. Should get banners finished any second now. Uh, as soon as banners are done, we'll upgrade these two units. Did I even research banners? I did. Uh, so that means that you guys should be able to... Yeah, okay, we, we can upgrade you with banners now. Good. Uh, both your banners, awesome. Um, not ideal they've got some troops behind us did I click? yeah okay we have recruited some archers here you guys make your way up here uh, and attack these uh, give your banners out not ideal they just wiped out all of our hunters will be dead here uh, nice very good knew the hunters weren't going to last forever so that's fine how many troops have they got? <laughs> jeez Oh, we're going to have to try and plug this gap as much as possible. Uh, did we build two? No, we only built one of them. It's fine. You make your way down. You try and assist. Uh, let's give my guys a, a buff. Uh, 
Yeah, okay, I built one of the, another unit of them coming out as well. Siege, let's buy two siege works. Bring the siege works to here. Um, okay, so they are bombarding us from the sea. That's okay, I guess. Um, siege works, but I'll tell you to go build you there. Fine. Uh, you guys can meet here. Um, looks like we've lost one unit of our uh, of our unit. Oh, one unit, believe it or not. Move up here. Let's regather. Uh, you guys have leveled up. Awesome. They do just have this random guy just standing around. Interesting. Uh, we've got a load of archers chasing our infantry. And of course they've got... Um, okay, looks like we are going to probably have to push here. Uh, so we want another unit of archers, another one of these. Ideally we'd want some more upgrades for them as well. Where are our... We had another unit of archers coming down. You guys keep making your way down. Let's heal. Let's get you guys a banners. Uh, I don't really want you to be attacked, to be honest. Uh, how much damage can you do to this? Uh, we're good if you can hit it. Uh, you guys... Those are taking a fair bit of damage here. Uh, let's build a... Should have a spare build around here somewhere. There he is. Build a... A heal. And then how's everything going up here? So they've got some random... You guys can just actually quickly take care of him. Not sure what he's trying to accomplish, but he's trying to accomplish something. Uh, let's get ourselves... We need level 3 for that, don't we? Yes, we do. So that's going to cost a thousand. Let's get ourselves better... Um, better weapons for our, our melee units. Which are just here. Annoying that they've got so many um, ships. That's fine. Melee units, you guys make your way down here. Awesome. I think I've got a second one of you. Yeah, I've got two of you coming down. Good. You are. You have been upgraded. Fine. Um, so we've got just... Oh god, how good are these? Uh, I guess they're pretty good. But let's get ourselves better arrows first. Um, Legolas, you're doing well. Uh, how many archers have we got here? So these are two units up. That is really annoying. You guys just move over here. Uh, you guys are all going together. You guys are team two. Let's see if we can just do a level up on all of our archers here. Should have some more troops making their way down. I believe. No, nope, oh no, I dedicate myself on buying some more um, resources, not resources, some more upgrades. Okay. So we're in a good place at the moment, I'd, I'd say. Um, let's build a... It's really annoying they've got that there. Let's build another elite barracks down here. There we should... This is almost done. Once we get this, we can then upgrade all of the arrows and we can start sending our troops in. I think that'd be probably the best bet. Annoyingly, they've got something firing at us from the sea. Just there. It seems to have like enchanted arrows. There we go. Let's see if we can take that out quickly. Nope, you missed. The other one going to hit. There you go. That's that taken out. Good. Right, so I think we've now got the ability to buy better arrows, we do. Awesome. And we only have two melee units here. You guys can buy better swords as well, better steel. It's going to cost a bit. Uh, allies look like they're failing up here. Orange seems to be out of the battle. With that in mind, let's start actually pushing. Uh, I don't really care about all these troops down here. Uh, do we need any more troops back here? We, ideally, we would. Let's just keep pushing. Let's see. Hopefully, we can take care of at least one enemy. And then we can push further and deeper into the enemy uh, force. All enemy, enemy units within the radius lose leadership. Summon an elven waystone. Waystone is made to teleport target units to location. Interesting. Uh, let's go for... Let's go for this one. Elven King's Patience. 
don't know if that's any good, but we'll see. Okay, you guys are still just behind. Good. Um, can we build any other heroes here? Heroes? Uh, no, they're quite expensive. I think one unit's down. Okay, so pink is destroyed. Good. I didn't do anything to destroy them, but pink is gone. We'll build. We'll upgrade this location here. Uh, you guys start attacking. We'll just support yellow here. And just hope our allies over this side can just hold its own. Actually, no. With that in mind. They might not be able to hold their own. So let's build up a small force here. One, two, three. And then build two units of warriors. I think that might be able to do it. So you guys continue to make your way down. Okay, yeah. So we want to focus on these buildings over here. We can. Right, so that's... Uh, then we want ideally three of those, or maybe two of them. Don't be too greedy. Awesome, Legolas has just leveled up. Let's slowly fire these from, from afar. Okay, they're almost going down. Um, let's, you guys all focus on this builder. They also have a ram down, which is ideal. Okay, that's down. Good. You guys will attack this. And then I'll let my two ballistae attack that. Uh, ooh, I didn't want them all to go down here. So you guys come up back up. Good. Managed to catch them before too many left. Uh, you guys sh really should be on the front line. We're going to be honest. Um, but that's fine, I guess. You guys attack that. Yeah, it's really annoying that my these guys have just decided to go straight onto the front line. But I guess that's okay. They can't level up, so I won't lose any experience for them here. Uh, okay, that's fine. You guys keep going. Keep attacking them. Actually, you guys go attack these guys up here. Let's get my Ballistar to do as much damage as possible. Right, you guys are the free. Uh, let's get you all of that and all of you of that. Right, let's keep you away from the water. Um, annoyingly, if we guys go down there, you're going to get attacked. Uh, but if we can mow as many of these down as possible. Oh, that's a big army. Um, I don't think I'm going to be able to take these. I'm going to be honest. My troops are have been upgraded. We'll see. If we can do enough damage back in their um, way in their in their kind of soft underbelly, we might be okay here. Right, let's build. Let's make our troops stronger. You guys actually fight rather than running around. Uh, this is the... I do actually have an issue with the AI of the Age of the Ring mod. As you can see here, it, it, it just does its own thing. Don't know why. Right, you guys are going to keep pushing forward. I just hope that my force, my defense, can actually hold out. Right, there is a great tree here. Uh, so you guys attack this tree. Uh, I think it's just a normal uh, Malon tree. Uh, no, you actually no, no. You guys just stay where you are. Oh, I pressed the wrong troops. Right, so we need to find. These are just their Bob Standard resource buildings. Uh, so we need to find their, ideally their main production. Right, so we've got a couple of builders. Let's build some more resource buildings. You build one over here. You guys build one further down. Right, let's... Okay, these are their resource buildings. Good. Right, you guys start attacking that. My Ballista are just going to follow up from behind. You guys are all in the same team together. Uh, so, fine, we're waiting for those. 
They slowly inch up. I quite like these uh, these troops. They're actually quite good. So we are just going to slowly inch up. You guys don't need to go on the very front line. You guys can just all rock back here as well. Um, you want to build a healing well for these troops just here. And you just want to keep keep expanding. You guys are going to just keep attacking. My ballista here are going to be what's going to do a lot of the damage. You guys are going to kill those first. So we don't really want to get into archer range uh, just yet. So what have we got here? So we've got lights out. We also summon an army of... Okay, let's summon those. Uh, with that in mind, we have a bit of money. Let's, re let's get some more heroes out. Then you can all meet there. Really annoying that they've got these stupid ships. I don't really want you guys to keep going forward. Go and fight this. It's almost destroyed. Before they spawn an ant. No mind, they managed to spawn the ant. But you guys all attack. Take out that ant. Um, okay, you guys all okay, I guess. Uh, why are you attacking that random woman running away? Just leave her be. Let her live. Uh, so let, let's build another... Let's just keep spamming out all the heroes we can. So we've got one unit of swordsmen here. Three units of archers. So you have taken a bit of a hit. hit. So we've got a, a relatively good force up here, which is obviously useful. Uh, Radagast is on the field, good. Uh, you guys definitely don't want to be in your range of that, that's for sure. Yeah, that's attacking us, okay. That's a part of the fortress. Uh, these are also part of the fortress, yeah, Axelf. Uh, let's buy some more heroes. You and then I can almost afford you as well. So you're just going to send you buff up this force we've got here. Okay, so focus on their fortress now. Both these siege weapons. Not ideal that managed to take care of those. We've got some horsemen going past. You guys come back. Right, let's build stuff down here. No, stop. Stop charging in. You don't need to. Just be defensive. Uh, this army up here. Okay, fine. We can probably get some of these. So once the fortresses are down, I'll be relatively content. You guys can stop being shot at, please. Fortress is almost down. How much health has it got? Okay, it's almost down. Good. Uh, we have got some more points here. Okay, two far, uh, 25 is what we need for the next upgrade. That's okay. Uh, we can probably get two of these. Steal yourself. Yeah, cause it's just the initial fight, which I struggle with on soldier difficulty. Uh, this guy's rebuilt. Isengard's rebuilt. That's good. Uh, yellow's done relatively well. Uh, have we got all the heroes out? All the heroes are out. Good. We stand in we have to the Elven the enemy oh, which means these guys will need upgrades when they all come out as well. Our woodwork is second to none. Okay, that's I my build and good. I just kind of panicked me for a second there. Right, their fortress is down. Which is very good for us. Okay, oh, these, these troops seem pretty cool. Uh, so that's 80. So let's put us to 860... We should have enough for two there. Load another one, will you? It's just sad we've only got one uh, one blister now. That's fine. We'll make it do. Uh, this army probably doesn't need to defend here anymore, to be quite honest. We have but once we've built... Okay. Um, we must this, all this army is now built, so we can actually... Annoyingly, they're, send, they're attacking us from down here. 
It's fine. I don't really want to send my entire army down here just to take out a couple guys attacking a tree, to be, to be honest. Who's this? I, mean, I don't know why this is charging in. This, whoever this is may destroy our blister. Okay, it didn't manage to destroy our blister. It's good. Uh, let's see. A blister is being shot at from all these quite well upgraded Malon trees. Okay, our blister's down. That really is annoying that it just charges in like that. But you guys just just go attack this. Uh, so you guys are team three. You guys are going to have to make your way down here. See if we can build a siege works down here as well. Uh, siege works is this one siege ground. And I let these guys just just kind of just do what they want to do really. Uh, okay, these guys need to definitely be taken care of. Uh, so this isn't, isn't going as well as I wanted it to, but our main army is on its way down. Uh, so we can now summon this great hunt of the uh, of Orm. It's just a big debuff and a buff for us. I don't know how good that is. Uh, let's just drop that there, I guess. This is your end. Did tell you guys to take out that tree. For the realm. You How's this siege going? So this is almost done. Let's upgrade you. We can now build down here a hill thing. You guys make your way back. Uh, we want to upgrade this one as well. Where is Marva? Okay, you are part of the army for some reason. Awesome. Uh, can you not charge in? Uh, let's get them all to start fighting, I guess. Clear out all of this chaff they've got lingering around. Uh, that's not ideal. Uh, that just wiped out so many troops. Right, you guys now will make your way down here. So we want... Um, you want that? I uh, want two of you blisters. You can upgrade this as well to max. Must be defended. Be ready. Okay, good. That's now finished. So now we can get this a leadership bonus. Um, I'm surprised this army is still surviving, to be honest. Um, okay, what's attacking us now? Of course. Okay. So the enemy are just focusing on um, watercraft um, ships. Which is fine by me. They're just, they're just wasting we their time, wasting their uh, their money, because uh, I'm not going to bother with fighting them at sea. Uh, let's get a couple of these. And here's my forces. So Grimborn, what skills have you got? Um, just a passive buff. Radagast is this boy. This is Radagast, not Grimborn. Um, Frangel, Elven King. He makes some people art uh, stronger. Actually, to fair, I'm just going to leave them be. Um, leave them be. You guys are all... Definitely don't want to add my builder into this pile. You guys are all together now. You guys are all now team number one. Let's get you guys to all attack. Siege weapons are on their way out. Uh, you guys want to focus on their troops first. Uh, that's for sure. Uh, siege weapon, you can start attacking their buildings. Right, awesome, you guys can join them up here as well. Uh, Frangel taking the bit of damage here. I'm not actually sure where he is, to be honest. Oh, he's there. Alright, let's get my siege weapon to start attacking this. Uh, just going to clear out everything we've got, or everything they've got. Two siege weapons are up, good. You both are going to attack what they've got left. And those um, those cavalry just did a suicidal charge. A little bit bold of them, to be honest, but that's fine. Give our archer some more upgrades. 
This fight is done. Stop them here. And have we lost a hero? Um, requires a Bjorn in Lodge to be built. Fine. Uh, I guess we can just get some of these upgrades as well. Uh, is that the enemy now down? Yes, so there's just one more faction left. You guys all gather together. You all team one. Uh, we need a Grimbjorn Lodge to uh, call in um, Bjorn in himself. I had to think about what his name was just then. Uh, you guys come back here. Um, so we can call in some more of you. We can one more unit of these melee. Uh, really cool looking melee units. Uh, let's see what we can call in from here. Let's call in this. And yeah, so I'm happy with this little little uh, force you got down here. And now it's just this blue force which is stuck in between us and Isengard. I've not played as Isengard yet, so it would be interesting to play as them up at some point. But that, that, this is looking... Oh, they've got a mine launcher. That's really cool. Uh, has this unit finished being built? There, there they are. You guys just join these. Get your upgrades. Uh, Bjorn and Lodge, what we can get here? Woodman, Hunters, Druid of the Order. I think these are healers. You've got Bjorn and Berserkers. And you got beekeeping. I don't know what beekeeping does. Let's just buy that. Oh, I was just having a sip of wine. Uh, which now means we can in. Uh, where is he? Under here. And uh, get Bjorn in. We we'll just get him to come to Isengard's force up here. I don't know why we've got loads of. Oh, that's how Isengard survived. They built some buildings behind me. Uh, so what's this? Cause it nearby enemies uh, to run in fear. Right, so this is going to be pretty tough to take care of. We've got loads of troops. We don't have a way of um, destroying a load of forces. So normally, if you're evil force, you get the Balrog and stuff like that. We don't have that. So we kind of just have to brute force our way in. We, I guess we have the troops to brute force our way in. Um, so we've got a couple defensive buildings. Loads and loads of cavalry here. Uh, they are Rohan, aren't they? Yes, they are Rohan. So, I've got a teammate over here. He has got some forces. Would be good if he sent them in. Is there a way I can... Can't view stats. Can I... Okay, looks like I can't. It'd be nice if I can just tell them, Hey guys, how about we attack this? But I guess I can't do that. Okay, let's upgrade that. Grimbjorn has arrived. He's pretty cool. He's a big old man. He can... Uh, so, he gives... Um, Bonuses to nearby Bjornins when activated. Instills fear into into some orcs nearby. It's a strong man. I'm surprised he's not in his bear form, to be honest. He can summon some bodyguards. Oh, yeah. Okay, number 10. Uh, he can turn into a boar for 90 seconds. I will guide you. So that is... Okay, that might be the cue we needed. Um... So we can now send our troops up. Isengard were a little bit foolish to actually attack. So we get our Blister to do a lot of um, all of the range damage. And these guys are just going to be countering any any troops that come towards us. Let's keep slowly moving up. It's going to be a slow fight. Blister, once you're in range, to take out that building there. Here they come. Uh, let's use our bonuses here. Let's use this. I don't know how useful that's going to be. It's not useful at all. That's fine. Doing an attack move on my force. Now you guys attack this. Um, so it looks like if we can destroy these buildings, they'll lose their ability to summon. Uh, call in more troops. Right. Grimbjorn, you, you, you help Isengard. As much as I don't want to say that, Grimbjorn, you can probably help them. Right, I want to at least take out the stables. Uh, you guys attack this building here. This is just a normal farm. It doesn't matter if we take that out, to be quite honest. 
but the priority will be these um, essentially the resource buildings not resource buildings the um, the recruitment buildings okay that's down good you guys attack the fortress now okay keep pushing okay they've got some troops next to us Right, okay, they're taken care of. Let's see if we can take out these um, expansions. Let's just stop going so... Like, I might actually lose these guys here. Annoyingly. They just decided they wanted to get really nice and close to the action. Uh, let's go for... It's not really anything that's useful here. I guess the hill's useful. Woodland Feast. Put your hill on you guys here. Uh, let's put just a random tree up here, I guess. Just to annoy those guys. And... Uh, let's call in... Yeah, you guys can should now be able to attack that. Grimbjorn's level 3 now. He's just chopping everything away. You guys attack that. Where's Grimbjorn? Okay, he's still, still up here fighting. Good. have lost a substantial size of our army. Our heroes are all still alive though, which is good. Our blisters just doing good work as well. You guys push this side. I think we we probably wouldn't have lost as many troops if we aimed for this first, if the blister was able to take this out relatively quickly. Oh, so I can actually move the feast. Uh, so my troops can get a heal. So that's really useful. My troops can essentially get a heal while this is uh, active. How long is the... Okay, so it's a relatively good heal over time. Hey, Mr. Grimbjorn, how are you doing? Okay, let's get you down here. Let's get you into the fight. Let's see what how, what you can do. Although the battle's going to be over before you even get down here. He's obviously level 3, so he's doing quite well. Can be cast in any resource structure to spawn a supply a chest of supplies. Okay, well that's that mission over anyway. So oh no. Left a coffee on my side. <laughs> my coffee's now Stone Cold Steve Austin. That's fine by me. We managed to win a match. I'm happy about that. So let's go through all these now. That's that's finished. So units. Yep, yeah, so this is weird. The AI on the Age of the Ring mod, it's starts off amazingly well look at this huge graph look at this photograph but then if you can survive about 10 minutes time 10 minutes into it it seems like every single time i play this so if you survive 10 minutes against soldiers everything just drops off uh structures as well they just massive boom then they then it just plateaus resources man, i can't i can't judge the resources because they have fake resources and the final score yeah uh, so it's about the 10 minute mark about here where they just suddenly start dropping but that's fine i enjoyed that um there's a 4v4 uh units created we created 233 units we lost 277 they've created an unholy amount of units i wouldn't be able to deal with using that many units um this word <laughs> come uh, my favorite unit was come apparently <laughs> nice <laughs> uh awesome uh so we'll end this episode if you made this far, thank you much for watching. I uh, hope to catch you next week. We do more Battle for Middle Earth every single Monday. So have a wonderful week and peace out.